the beginning of phase two. I'm going to have an 11 inch insulated cavity, six inch concrete wall, and then another slab, maybe the same thickness as this, and that will be the base of the sand battery. Then there'll be concrete all out here, more insulation, thick walls. I don't, it's going to be detailed later, but I won't worry about any of that. First of all, just get the sand battery done. And then if I have to sleep in a tent, just to test it out in the first few months, <laughs> it's getting done no matter what. All the new concrete staged here. New batch of screws, 70 bucks. Everything's gone up, I'll tell you. These are the trusses I made. One of them's twisted. I made this about three, two years ago for my other property, but I brought them over here. This is going to be for the the shed I drew up with the sand, the uh, solar panels will go on top of. More rebar. I should have this second phase concrete poured, this little wall cavity for uh, insulation. Maybe by this weekend, for sure, sometime next week, if not this weekend. Okay, so as of now, I've got the five and a half inch slab. From there, I'm going to go up another eleven and a half inches. Well, I guess it's, 11, I don't know, 11 inches, whatever it looks out to be. This is going to be a six inch thick wall. And this will be filled with insulation. So, from a front view, as we used to call it, <laughs> side view, five and a half inch slab. 11 inch insulation wall and then I'll have another five and a half maybe four probably five and a half inch and this would be the base floor of the sand battery so there it just continues up but at that point I'll start using block I've never did block, so it's going to take. I bought. I got some books on it, and uh, it come out a little rough, probably. But it's just a sand battery, so we don't really care if it looks pretty. So there's my old hammer drill. I'll be drilling holes into the concrete, putting rebar, another set of forms on the outside, obviously. Be full of rebar. <laughs> 